Okay, I'm just gonna show how you can make an object look like it's um, falling in and like poking or stabbing into something. In this case, I just have a pin dropping into the period of the uh, letter yeah, here. So it's really easy, you just have to put a mask over it. Um, but when I was first doing this, the mask um, just stayed in the same place the whole time. So that when the pin was like dropping in, the mask was still covering up the bottom part of the pin here. So to fix that, it's really easy. You just have to adjust the anchor points a little bit. So I would put the keyframes down of where you want your object to come in from and then where you want it to land at. So I have it landing right here. And then once you have it positioned there, I would put in the mask. And so I have the mask inverted and it's just positioned at an angle over the bottom of the pin like this. So make sure you place a keyframe over mask path here. And then I would scrub backwards to the start of when the object is falling. And you just want to adjust the anchor points of the mask so that it's really nothing here at the top. Um, and that way, when your object is moving in, there's like nothing there. So as long as you have a keyframe placed here, um, the mask will start expanding as your object is moving. Um, in my case, it doesn't expand over the pin until it's landed, because it's such a short amount of time. But if you need to, I would place another keyframe right before it lands, so that way it only expands um, when you need it to.